Hi again, friends. It's Shanna, Shop Glorious Day, and I am visiting with everybody right nearby here. Um, so I'm going to introduce you and take you around the corner there in that tent that you can't see inside in just a minute. Um, I'll turn you around. I'm right outside Tom Bombadil Meadery, who we visited with, and there he is there. I'll turn the camera around so you can uh, see that and uh, where we are, and then we'll go uh, show you something new. The Tom Bombadil Meadery. <laughs> so <fun. laughs> Okay, and then this is, look, I'll just give you a little peek. Oh, a sneak peek inside. The little back door at Zap Hall with the windows open. And there's Anna. Hey, <laughs> good to see you. And then, oh gosh, we were gonna sneak up on the surprise. <laughs> special effects. Jeff's amazing space here. Here, how about we start down this end? Come on down. Maybe we'll start with these. I'd love for, I'm just going to zoom in a little bit. Well, why don't you tell us a little, just about kind of overview of what your business is and what you make? Uh, everything is vintage antique, civil plate. Yeah. I'm a second generation maker. My parents made. Yep. They taught me quite a bit. Yeah. Ah. Yeah, and she's somewhere in another field. Okay, yeah, nice. So you've been doing it for how long? I've been doing it for about 25 years. Wow. Yep, yeah. yeah. I was sharing with Jeff, I'll kind of just give a little peek here. My first love ring, uh, that was my Grandma Farrigan's pattern, which I love a whole lot. Yeah, it was so fun that you even recognize the pattern, which I would, I guess, expect you to, given what you work with. <laughs> yeah, so let's talk about these. I love this. Look, we'll try to get this in so you can. Art chime rack, yeah. Art chimes. Yeah. Look, I'll bring them in close, but As look. Right now, I'm the only one doing them. There's a lot of spoon makers out there, but nobody's doing the art chimes. And the... Look at this one. Love them. Pelicans and trailers and coca pellies and Texas flags. Yeah. Probably the hummingbird is probably my best seller. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. Look. And I do shows from Ohio to California, and that sells the best everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, it's really special. Look. I love that. All right, so let's go over here. And this this one just totally look at this guy. Does he have a name? Larry. Larry. <laughs> we just named him right now. Larry. <laughs> hey, Larry. Larry, the lizard. Larry, Larry the, lizard. the lizard is so cool. Sure, we got lizards and camels. Wait, look. Fishing guys and frogs. Fishing guys. <laughs> look at this, the camel. Oh, camel. What? Yeah, that used to be a, a creamer bowl. And a creamer bowl turned camel. I love yeah, that. Got yoga pose. And look at frogs, this guy. Got yoga frogs. Oh, look. Like the whole family is just. Wow. And then look at this back here. Look. A catfish. Yeah, look at the catfish. The elephants. My, that guy's. Probably one of my latest ones. The elephants Look always sell this. good. Yeah. So it's a coffee pot it kind used, of turned used, upside used, down. Yep, used to be a teapot. Look. Yep, used to Look. be a teapot. Put some fork tines on there, and then the ears are off a 1920 uh, 1920 candy dish that I found. No so I kidding. Ears and then the that. front piece is yeah. one of. Is a leg off of something, or? No, that's the spout. Oh, that's it really. That's that's the tea spout. Yeah. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, oh. Down. I yeah. thought you had attached it. Nope. Oh my gosh! Nope. Look. <gasps> I love yeah, all of these. We got, yeah, we Look at the cowboy playing. Yeah, singing cowboys. Singing cowboys, and then what's this up here? We, we have this just a. Oh, how fun! And you design them all. I make everything, all original ideas. Oh, I love them so much. And then these all are just love. Yep. 
knives and forks and yeah this i've never seen with the marbles. the marbles and then i made that so they're interchangeable that can be forced out and then i give more marbles and you can change the colors up wow those are great rings and then pendants and hearts more on the heart theme here lots of hearts yeah the angels Angel wait pendants, what yes. look at these angels These are oh, these are bells, and, yes. You know, I do elephants and bells. And you see, this one's just balanced on there. That just rests right in that little divot. Oh, my goodness. And he chases, <gasps> his, chases his tail all day. <laughs> what? Yep, yep. And then look, these with the coins. That's really beautiful. Lots of pretty decorative handle bracelets, yeah. So Spring handle rings, bracelets there with the good... rings is how it all started. That's yep. Probably the first thing they ever made. Yep. Wow. Cut coins. Look at this. Oh wow, look at these too. They're hand cut. <gasps> that's that's a jeweler's coping saw, so drill a starter hole in it and start cutting. So every cut coin you see up here is hand cut by me. Oh on earth. Texas quarters were the first ones I cut, and I cut all 50 states. And then okay, I, I have to come hang out with you and watch yeah. you cut them because that's kind of, I can't even imagine. Look at yeah. these. Yeah, Hand cut. cut. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love Liberty's these, too. probably the toughest because I leave the letters around the outside, the Lady Liberty around the outside. Yeah. You hand cut that. Hand cut. You hand cut that. <laughs> Literally hand cut. Is he telling us the truth or what? Hand yes. cut. Yes, they're hand what? cut. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh my gosh. So we're gonna we're gonna have to get evidence of that and witness it. Put them in earrings too. Put a sterling silver feather on some. Cut the nickels different ways. We've got Texas cutouts. We got more dime cutouts. So Lady Liberties with the, leaving the letters around outside. Lady Liberty. Indian hit pennies. Yep. Look at the necklace here. Yep. One of a kind piece. And so we'll pan across your signs: silver to wear and more by Jeff Almond. That's like me. Almond without a D. That's right. All right. So this is why right. I love to end my videos had so much fun i love this Me space too. and it's so fun getting a real close look so come and see jeff right across from royer's when you're here over the next several days here at zap hall and you're i i expect you'll spend some time and find some things you fall in love with too so thank you jeff for sharing your art with us i love it you're welcome thanks, thanks for again coming back. shanna shop glorious day bye for now